taking you today. We're actually going to be taking the Q60. Dang. That interior, though. <laughs> Looking sexy. And this one? Oh, my goodness. Don't get tired of this car at all. All right, you guys. What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Speed Corey 6, coming to you with another video. As you guys can see, we are in the Q60 today. Uh, we're actually gonna be going to a cool Nismo Nights uh, barbecue. So that's pretty dope, man. So we're heading to the shop right now. And don't mind my freaking steering wheel. I for sure need alignment. Like, my steering wheel is so crooked, it's crazy. And I've just been, <laughs> I've been lagging, man, on doing this car and stuff like that. But, got a Q50, Q50 fam right there. Honestly, you guys, I love Q50s. Like, they're perfect. It's liable 3.7 liter and all that. You can't go wrong with that. But you know, I'm a VR boy too. <laughs> Obviously I got a Q60, so. Should I do a pull on the fucking uh, the Q60? <laughs> Let's see. It's so slow. <laughs> bro, y'all see my steering wheel? I need an alignment, bro. <laughs> I for sure need an alignment. Pull up right now. Alright, so we just park the key. Right here. Yeah, four. That's right here. Okay. Tacos. Good. Alright, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Red onion in the front. Oh, for sure. Thank you. Your cap right here. Is that the G that I have on the G? That's inspired by the yeah, Instyle. You guys always hit me up and ask me where, where did I get them. Got mine from? I got them from South Bay. So they were, but they were the, the prototype. So, but damn, this is so clean. Should I start selling M4s? Mm. This is so cool. Honestly, that's the next cars I for sure want to sell. M4s and then GTRs for sure. This is so clean, you know. back at the dealership and I just got the call right now that my other Q60 is basically here so I wanted to show you guys this one this one will be for sale no the Nismos won't be on the car when I sell it everything else will carbon lid um, the mirror caps and then the sequentials as well so all right so the guy said he's here I'm not too sure where exactly he is so I'm gonna go find him make sure nothing crazy happens to the car got that Q50 for sale right there you have on. I think I see it. So the guy ended up parking his truck on that street right here. And I'm pretty sure that's it right there. Oh my gosh, it already looks freaking clean, bruh. I can't wait. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> There she is. There she is, you guys. Right there? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Look at it, you guys. Nice that pearl. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there she is. There she is, you guys. Man. <laughs> you jacked the seat? Yeah. Wow. Look at that. There we go. 
And then the uh, wheels are already powder coated black. I don't know if it came like that stock. I'm not too sure, but we'll dig into it. But oh my gosh, I'm so excited. A little bit of paint damage. Oh, that's just dirt. That's just dirt. All right. Ooh, doing my quick little inspection. Oh my goodness, you guys. Let's get it. A new Q60 Red Sport. Oh my gosh. So as you guys can know, I actually had a Red Sport before, but I ended up selling it and I've regretted it ever since I sold it. And I basically bought this one, but it's not the Red Sport. So it's not the same thing, you know? So, man, so this is a one owner, uh, 2018 with only 30,000 miles on it. Uh, clean title. You guys know I don't do anything salvage title. So the clean title. And I absolutely love the co color combination. It's just so clean. Oh my God, Jordan, pulled up. But it is so freaking clean. Oh my God, bro. It's crazy. <laughs> Ew. Ew. You guys, I'm literally in love with this thing. Like it's so clean. And it's funny because I wanted to wrap my other Q60 white. So that's another reason why I wanted to go ahead and buy this one because I was going to wrap my other Q60 and not make it like a Red Sport, but just keep doing stupid stuff to it to try to make it seem like a Red Sport, like upgrade the brakes, try to get paddle shifters. And I was like, you know what? And I saw this car, I'm like, let's just go ahead and buy it. Like, let's just get it. This is exactly what I want. So we're about to go on a test drive real quick just to drive it, just feel it. We only got 31,000 original miles on this thing. No check engine light or anything like that. So that's good. Plus really quick. Yeah, so if you guys have a premium Q60, you only have Sport. You don't have Sport Plus. Like, Sport Plus is only for the red sports, so. All right, here we go, guys. First little drive in the queue. The new red sport. Let's do it. Uh, I'll do it like a little 20 roll real quick. Woo! Oh, my gosh. Hey, look at you guys. I'm not even gonna lie. This thing pulls. For a stock car, no tune or anything like that, this thing actually pulls. It's just a little quiet though, obviously. I need to get an exhaust on this thing ASAP. But for the new daily, I'm super excited, super happy with this thing. I can't wait to see what I do with it. Man, it's just, I'm super, I'm happy. <laughs> I cannot complain, cannot complain. Next day. <laughs> you guys, I'm in love with this thing. It's crazy how this car is completely stock and just looks good. It looks good. I can't wait to really hook this thing up. Oh my gosh. But yeah, we're about to head to the dealership right now because I'm going to start cleaning out my other Q60 and just start transferring things over. Um, but yeah, man. Oh, this thing is fire. Love it. All right, so first mod to the Q60 was going to be installing my carbon wing. But um, the Red Sport, this wing actually is attached to the trunk. And this is how it comes from the factory. Um, so with that being said, this wing, it would look funny if I just put it on by itself, you have showing all that, which is disgusting. So basically I thought I was just gonna swap the wings, put this wing on the old Q60, but that is not the case. So I have to buy a new wing for that one, which is fine. Um, but yeah, so I gotta, this has to stay on there basically, but it fills in this little gap right here. And it actually looks a lot better when it's on, it looks more aggressive. Like it looks like the whole trunk is covered. They do sell some type of wings that cover the whole trunk, but I don't feel like spending more money than I have to, so I'm gonna do it this way. <laughs> I'm gonna put this wing back on, like that. Just like that, put this wing back on, and it works out perfectly because it has a little bit of, and then this is gonna go on top of this, like that. Now this is a mock-up. And now it's gonna look way more aggressive. Look at that, looks way better. So, that's what we will be doing. You guys, check it out. Damn, that shit looks so good. It looks so much more aggressive since it has the stock wing right here as well. So it fills in this part. They have wings too that actually hook the trunk a little bit more. And now they're, they're more like 200 bucks versus just like the 130. So, but obviously I got it looking pretty good. Bro, that butt looks way more aggressive now. It looks so good, so good. I'm gonna try to put a comparison between how it looked on my, on this Q60 
um, before. Before it didn't look as good because it didn't have the lower part that hooks the trunk a little bit more. But now this makes it look super clean. But all right, guys, I think that's gonna do it for this video. Um, definitely make sure you guys tune in. I'm, I can't wait to build this car because this color, the color combination is literally perfect, exactly what I wanted to do. So definitely already, already ordered some parts. So I got the front lip coming. Um, I'm gonna be talking to my boy to get the side skirts done. Um, gonna be putting the mirror caps on and then also the sequentials this time. This time, I'm not gonna be going with the same style that I had on that Q60. I'm going to go be going with the blacked out sequential. So you only see it whenever I turn the car on and off, which is perfect because I feel like it's going to tie into all this, especially when I, once I do a Chrome delete on it. So, but yeah, I'll just show you guys that wing. I'm really excited how the wing came out. It looks really good. It looks really good. Look at that. It just looks so aggressive, man. But yes, sir. But that's going to do it for the video, guys. Go ahead and like and subscribe to the channel. Definitely helps out the channel. Um, Make sure you guys turn on your post notifications too. A lot of my subscribers are telling me that they do not get my, see my videos when they pop up when I first post them. So make sure you guys, you know, follow your boy and turn on that post notification so you get updates on the new Q60. Get that interior real quick. Jeez, look just like the IPL. <laughs> well, yeah, peace.